Hello everyone, welcome back to Pabli. In this video, we're going to learn how to build an AI agent WhatsApp chatbot for e-commerce business. So I'm an owner of a fashion apparel store that is my e-commerce business and I receive a lot of queries by my customers on WhatsApp very regularly. Now replying to each one of them individually and manually is a very time consuming and hectic task. So to solve this problem, I have created an AI agent WhatsApp chatbot using Pabli chat flow. So now as I've created this AI agent using Pabli chart flow whenever I'm going to receive any of the inquiries by the customers on WhatsApp this bot is going to reply automatically to each and every inquiry as we have added a knowledge base and you can add this AI agent on your website as well so now if you want to learn how to create this amazing AI agent WhatsApp chart bot for yourself for your business using Pabli chart flow then let me take you to my screen in this video, we're going to learn how to create an AI powered WhatsApp assistant using Pabli chart flow for your e-commerce business. This AI assistant will help you automate customer support, guide users through your products, answer common queries and provide smooth shopping experience all through WhatsApp. Now, before I'm going to dive into the setup process, firstly, I'm going to show you how this AI agent works for a customer's point of view. So you can experience exactly what buyers will see and how it interacts in real time. So this is the AI assistant bot right over here and towards this I'm going to send a message that is I need help okay I'm going to send this message towards this AI assistant right over here and you can see automatically I have received a reply I'm here to help. What would you need assistance with? So my first question over here is going to be I want to know about the written policy in your business. Okay, I'm going to send this question towards this assistant. And within few seconds, you can see automatically this AI assistant has replied. Certainly, here's our overview on return policy. Return policy overview, return window, seven days of delivery, condition, the items must be unused in original packaging and tags intact. No eligible products, certain items such as innerware, sale items are not eligible for return. You can see automatically this AI agent has replied to the query that I forwarded to it. This is how this AI agent WhatsApp chatbot is going to work in real time. I can ask any other questions as well towards this AI agent and it is going to send me a reply. And we are going to create this amazing AI assistance with the help of Pabli chart flow. For that on a new tab I am going to browse the website of Pabli chart flow that is www.pabli.com slash chart flow. After browsing the website Pabli chart flow's landing page is going to appear in front of you on which you have two options sign in or sign up for free if you're an existing user directly sign into your Pabli chart flow account but if you're a new user you can sign up for free and get 100 free tasks every month i'm going to sign into my Pabli chart flow account after signing in the all Pabli apps window is going to appear in front of you in which you can see all the applications that Pabli provides as we have to use Pabli chart flow i'm going to click on this access now button right over here then after that Pabli chart flow's dashboard is going to appear in front of you what is Pabli chart flow it is a tool that helps businesses to send whatsapp messages and manage whatsapp conversations effortlessly in order to set up your own pabli chart flow account you need to add the whatsapp number from here and you can find two options whatsapp connect and manual token connect if you want to learn any of the methods in order to set up your own pabli chart flow account you can check out the links of the videos in the description box below of the tutorials pabli chart flow provides multiple features like inbox contacts team queues templates broadcast flows air assistant activity log settings under which you have multiple Multiple options. If you want to learn about each and every feature of Pabli chart flow in brief, you can check out the videos that we have already created and uploaded on our YouTube channel and I've also added them in the description box below. In order to create a new AI agent WhatsApp chatbot, we need to create an AI assistant in our Pabli chart flow account. For that from the left side, you can see this option AI assistant, click on it right here. This AI assistant page is going to appear in front of you and this AI assistant is going to solve the problems for my customers using the knowledge base that we are going to add to it okay for adding a new AI assistant in our Pabli chart flow account click on this add AI assistant button right here firstly we have to name the assistant which is going to be customer support bot okay I'm going to give this name to this assistant and add the AI assistant from here as I've done that, you can see a new AI assistant has been created in the name of customer support bot. You can change the name from here as well. Now we have to select the type of the AI assistant that we are creating. 
I am creating an AI agent, AI assistant right over here that is going to reply to my customer's message through AI. Okay, so I'm going to select the AI assistant type over here as AI agent. And as soon as you get to select the type, the instruction for the AI agent is automatically going to appear right here. If you want to make any changes and add few points and add more points in the instructions, you can definitely do that according to your requirement. Okay, so you can make changes right here after that you can see it says temperature range will be from 0 to 1 where 0 is reserved and 1 is creative so now you have an option from 0 to 1 to select the temperature temperature is the creativity of the response if you need the most creative response you can select the option 1 and if you want a very simple response you can select it as 0 I am keeping the temperature as 0 0.1 as I need the response in between the creative and a simple response okay then it says select AI to use. I am using OpenAI right over here as my AI agent. If you want to use any other AI assistant, you can add it right over here. And for that, you can contact us on Pabli Forum. Okay. So I'm going to select my AI over here as OpenAI. For the model, I'm using GPT-40 Mini. But if you want to use any other AI model from the OpenAI, you can select it from the drop down according to your requirement. And after that, it is asking for the API token. To have the API token, go to this hyperlink given here below in the help desk right here. And you're going to be forwarded towards the API keys page of your OpenAI account. Create the new token from here. Firstly, name the token, which is going to be new token. Okay, for the project, I'm going to select it as default project permissions. I'm going to give all the permissions from here and create the token from here. A token is generated. You have to copy this token and paste it in this API token field right over here. And after pasting the API token, click on this connect button right over here. It says open AI key saved successfully. This means now we have successfully added the AI agent right here. Okay. After completing this AI instruction section, now we have to go to our knowledge source. So now what is this knowledge source over here in this we are going to upload a file that is going to be the knowledge base of my business. Okay, so I'm going to show you the knowledge base that I have created. So this is the knowledge base that I've created for my business. My business name is V Vogue Fashion. Okay, over here I have firstly written the brand information right here. What all the things that we provide in our business, our store experience and everything. And you can see I've mentioned all the social media handles. I have mentioned the support details as well. And then I have provided the details of the product that we provide. What are the sizes you can see right over here. And all the details you can see right here. I'm an owner of a fashion apparel store. So in this knowledge base I've added all the things that we provide in this I've also added the return exchange policy details refund details you can see right we have added in all the details in this knowledge base you can create more bigger knowledge base for your business as well this is just a test knowledge base that I've created for this video okay so this is the knowledge base right over here and using this data the AI agent is going to know about my business and automatically create a reply and send it towards my customer according to their inquiries. Now what we are going to do is we have to add that knowledge base over here. Knowledge source I am going to select as upload file and now I am going to upload the file over here for that I am going to click on this button. And you can see right over here this is the file that I have my knowledge base you can see right over here it is a txt file right here okay and then I am going to open this file over here in this knowledge base and automatically you can see right over here the file is successfully uploaded okay as now we have uploaded the knowledge base the section for the knowledge source is now been done okay now after that we are going to move forward to assistant interface now where for the assistant interface firstly we have to give the header display heading name so you can see right over here we are now going to design this interface so this is the header right over here what name should be here so over here for the name I'm going to write it as so this is the name we woke fashion bot you can see the name has been changed right here we woke fashion bot okay it says header display subheading name you can see the subheading we are online and happy to assist you if you want to make changes in the subheading you can definitely do that according to your requirement next is the initial message what is this first message that should be forwarded towards the customer if they ask an inquiry so this is the first message that is going to be forwarded to them hi there how can I help you today if you want to make changes you can add more messages as well right here okay 
After that, it says display the power by Pabli label. If you want to display this label right over here, you can enable it and disable it from here. I want it to be there, so I'm going to select it as enable, okay? Next, it says footer text. For the footer text, you can see this privacy policy right over here. You can change it according to your requirement. If you want that, I'm going to leave it as privacy policy. And over here, it is to add the link, okay? For the link over here, this is the footer link. You can make changes in this footer link and add your website link right here now it says user first message this message will be sent to whatsapp as an initial message from the user so usually i receive the initial message from my user as i need help so i have entered i need help right over here if you want you can make any changes according to your requirement now after that it comes fallback message so let's suppose a customer has asked me a question and this ai assistant is not able to understand the asked query so this fallback message is going to be forwarded towards my customer. You can make changes in this fallback message according to your requirement. I'm going to write over here the fallback message as this is my fallback message. Oops, I'm really sorry. I couldn't find the right answer for your question right now. Let me connect you with our support team at VV Fashion for better assistant. You can contact us directly, email us at this email or call us on this number. We'll make sure someone gets back to you as soon as possible. So this is my fallback message according to my e-commerce store right here, okay? So I have now set up this step that is assistant interface, okay? Now last is styling right here. If you want to make the theme over here as dark, you can select it. I want it as light, so I'm going to select it as light. For assistant shape, you can also change it as circle, square, or you can change it as rounded square. I'm going to select it as circle only, okay? You can see right over here, these are the different colors in HTML. For the theme, you can see right over here of this chart board. You can select it according to your brand over here. For the header profile picture, you can upload the picture directly right over here. I do not want that, so I'm going to skip the part. For the assistant profile picture, you can also change the assistant profile picture by uploading a picture right here. And for the background photo, you can remove this background from here and add your own background according to the theme of your agency, okay, of your e-commerce store. So now this is the entire AI assistant that I've created. I have completed all the sections right over here, okay. Now to save this AI assistant, we have to first toggle this button on of the AI assistant and click on this save AI assistant button right here. As I've done that, it says AI assistant saved successfully, okay. You have created this AI assistant and you can add this assistant on your website as well. The website of your business, you can directly add this assistant over there as well. In order for you to add this AI assistant on your website, go to this embedded option right over here next to save AI assistant. Copy it from here and add it in the code of your website. And automatically this AI assistant is going to be added on your website and customers can directly go to your AI assistant from your website. Okay. So now as I've added all the required details and as I've created this bot successfully using Pabli chart flow, now what I want is I want to test this AI chart bot. I'm going to send a WhatsApp message directly to this AI agent WhatsApp chart bot using my WhatsApp number. And after that, I'm going to check whether automatically this bot replies to all my messages or not. Okay, so this is the bot right over here. And towards this bot over here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to write a message. I need help. I'm going to send this message towards this spot right over here. And you can see right over here, this AI chat bot has replied to me. Of course, I'm here to assist you. What do you need help with? Okay, so for the question over here, I'm going to write it as, I want to know about the products that you provide for women. Okay, so this is the question that I'm going to send towards this AI assistant right over here. And automatically, you can see I've received the reply. We offer diverse range of products for women, tops, dresses, kurtis, Court sets, skirts, saris, ethnic wears. Okay, I can ask more questions to this bot as well right here. So you can see I've asked, I want to know is there any offer going on currently in your business? Over here, as soon as I'm going to send this message towards this AI bot, automatically you can see I've received the reply. Yes, we currently have several offers available. First order discount, seasonal sale, buy more, save more offers, WhatsApp exclusive deals. Okay, you can see right over here, this bot is auto replying to the to all the questions that I'm asking. This means that we have successfully created an AI assistance using Pabli chart flow.
And that's all for this video of building your own AI powered WhatsApp chatbot using Pabli Chat Flow. With this setup, your e commerce business can now offer 24 7 smart assistance, improve customers' experience, and save a lot of manual efforts. You can create this AI assistant chatbot for yourself for your business today using Pabli Chat Flow. So go ahead, browse the website of Pabli Chat Flow, and start creating your own AI assistant WhatsApp chatbot for your business today. So this was it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Not just this chatbot, you can create multiple other chatbots using Pabli Chat Flow. If you have any questions, you can send us email on support at the rate pabli.com. If you have any queries, you can ask us queries on forum.pabli.com. And if you have any pricing related issue in Pabli Chat Flow, you can check out this link. If you want to try your own test bot today with Pabli Chat Flow, you can do it absolutely for free as we provide 100 free credit points. So go and check out Pabli Chat flow today.